Hello guys, this is Amos Style Music and in today's lesson I'm going to teach you how to play the Let It Grow theme. So it goes like this, give you a preview, check it out, check it out. So melody and chords, that's the foundation of a song. Let's learn that right now. Here we go. Let's break it up into two parts so it's easier to learn. First part goes like this. Right hand starts on the E here. Middle C, go up an octave to this C. We start on this E right here. So it goes E, G, G, E, D, C. E, G, A, G, G, E, G, E, D. That's it for the first part for the right hand. Let's do it again. So it goes like this. E, G, G, E, D, C. Up to E, G, A, G, G, E, G, E, D. That's it for the right hand. Once you get the right hand there, left hand we have three chords here. The three chords are C major, which is C, E, G. So two of these C major chords. And then the third chord is G major, which is G, B, D. So these three chords in mind, so C major twice, followed by G major. Two hands together goes like this. So right hand starts. Second G and C major to get up. After A, C major by itself. After G, G major by itself. Like that. One more time. So it goes like this. To get up. Here. Here. And that's it for the first part. Okay, once you get that, moving on to the second part, right continues. It goes E, 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 D, D, C, C. D, C, E, D, C. That's it for the second part for the right hand. Let's do it again. So it goes like this. E, 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 D, D, C, C. D, C, E, D, C. And that's it for the right hand for the second part. Once you get that left hand, we have five chords here. The five chords are A minor, which is A, C, E. Second chord is F major, which is F, A, C. Third chord is D minor, which is D, F, A. And fourth chord G major, G, B, D. And fifth chord is C major, which is C, G. So with these five chords in mind, so A minor, F major, D minor, G major, C major. Two hands together goes like this. E and A minor together. Second D and F major together. D and D minor together. E and G major together. C and C major together. Like that. One more time, it goes like this. So together. And there you have it. So back to back, the two parts of uh, learned in this lesson would be played back to back like this. Check it out. Some parts of a song, uh, the like nearly the last part of it is like repeated, so it goes like this part's repeated, like you like repeat it, you repeat it a few times. They go to the da -da 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 -da. so yeah, sometimes it varies like that, so you can vary it like that as well for yourself, okay. So yeah, that's pretty much it. So yeah, um, after you've got the melody and chords for this, you can start to add other improvisations into it and um, decorations to make it more awesome. Okay, so left hand for the chords, you can do like octave, bass note, arpeggios, rhythmic patterns, that kind of thing. And right hand, you can harmonize the bass on the chords underneath to make it a thicker texture. So you'd be like. So once you got this, if you enjoyed this uh, particular song lesson, make sure to check out the rest of my channel because literally I have multiple thousands and thousands and thousands of these videos for you to enjoy and learn from. So most likely you can find your favorite song to learn on my channel. Anyway, also check out my website, bestpianomethod.com, linked in the description below if you want to learn more piano from me. 
learn how to play by ear, improvise, read sheet music, play and sing, and a lot of other cool stuff. So make sure to check that out. As for now, enjoy your time around my channel and see you next time. Tell me in the comments what you want me to cover or teach next, or use my services to guarantee a priority custom song request. For more information on all my other piano mastery courses, sheet music and books, check out the links in the description or visit my website bestpianomethod.com.